Hi YouTube, it's Selena, and I'm here today with my Mac Back to Mac Project Pan. And last time I had finished the Mac Pro Longwear Concealer, like literally the day that I filmed. I have not finished anything today, or this past month, but I have something that is a month from being done, probably, and another thing that's probably two months from being done. And that will get me the six products I need to back to back something. So hopefully in two months this project will be done. Now first off, first thing I have that I have not made a bloody dent in is this MAC blush. This is the Divine Desire MAC blush. It was from some collection a million years ago. But uh, it still looks the freaking same. It will always look the freaking same. Like, I wear it. It's not like I don't wear it. <laughs> it's just, it's a freaking blush. <laughs> it's never gonna end. I don't know what I was thinking. Well, I was thinking that I was probably not going to finish it, but I was hoping to like hit pan or something. Uh, next is the lipstick that I'm wearing, actually. This is the Vive Glam Ariana Grande lipstick. I have worn this twice in the past month, which is better than the month before, but still not great. Now this is something that I actually want to finish this year. I really, really do. But there's no point in showing you my paper, even though I probably... Well, let me show you the paper, because I didn't even bother to show it last month. I checked to measure it, and even though I've worn it a couple of times, I haven't made any, like, notable progress. But if you look at it, right there beside my finger, I have probably used up about a third of the lipstick, which is good. Now. I'm sure I will probably be wanting to wear this a lot more in the fall. Here, let me swatch it for you real quick. Because right now I have a gloss on top of it, but that's actually the blush right there too. It's very light with um, pale AF, so it's okay. So I'm hoping that once you know fall rolls around, I'm gonna be wanting to wear it more. Right now I'm doing more folk, like bright colors of the eyes for the most part, so this isn't really going with much. But hopefully we can make it work and I can finish it by the end of the year, even if it's not for this project. Because so, I mean, I've already made really good progress on it, so that would be nice to finish it before the end of the year. Next is something that I've actually made progress on, and this is something I'm really sure will be done in the next month. This is my Mac Fix Plus. I have not only also a mini of this, but I bought the uh, matte version that I really want to try out, but I don't want to bust into that until I finish this. Last month we were here, and now we are down to here. This bottle does taper in slightly, so I'm hoping that even though this is a little more than what I went through in the past month, uh, I'm hoping I can finish it. I need to just use it every day as like a toner or something too, but I hate to use it like that. But I mean, it feels really good on the face, and it smells really good too. Mm, I love it. I really do. And I know I have oily skin, but I use a mattifying setting spray on top of that and that's why I bought the matte version because I was like maybe I can just use one setting spray instead of two like the extra bitch that I am <laughs> but uh hopefully I do really think that I can finish this in the next month so there's no hoping I'm gonna do it I'm just gonna have to wear makeup every day no matter how crappy I feel because that's what happens to me a lot is that I feel crappy because I got, I got some health nonsense going on um vitamin d deficiency makes me want to not move for the most part but uh hopefully i can these vitamin d supplements will finally kick in and give me some damn energy and i can actually wear makeup every day like i want to but uh next is the mac turquatic perfume it's been very nice for summer dude the packaging on this look at this it's so pretty but uh I made good progress on this this past month because I started with it full and I've been measuring by this way so it's a little more visible but last month I was all the way up to here and now I'm down to here so I know I could finish this in two months it'd be awesome if I could finish this in the next month but I think that's just a little more product than I can use in a month it was like this past month was really good because we went from like not even halfway to past halfway done so crossing my fingers, two months, it'll be done. But like I said, if I did happen to finish this in a month, that would be amazing. 
but I don't want to waste this and use it as like a room spray too. I only, I use like two squirts on my neck and one on my wrist and that's all I use. I've just been remembering to wear it more recently. Even though I haven't been wearing a ton of makeup, I have been wearing my perfume every day so that I don't stay. And finally, I actually really don't like this because I'll tell you why in a second. This is my MAC eyeshadow in vanilla. I just kind of needed something to put in here so I figured I would put in an eyeshadow to set my primer with every day. When I initially bought this, even though on the website it says what every the finish of every eyeshadow is, I did not realize how much freaking shimmer was in this. I was thinking it was more satin, matte even, maybe. Can you see that? Probably not. But, uh, so I have, I have been using this to set my primer every day and it kind of doesn't blend as much as I would like. I haven't really been enjoying it. <laughs> and I have been using something else to use as a brow bone highlight because I really want that to be matte. So I use something else for that, but I have been using that every day. And while it does not really look, at least in the viewfinder, it does not really look like it's been used too much. I can see a little bit of wear on it when I look at it. Like, not in the realm of, you know, pan rings or anything like that, but just like, it doesn't look as smooth as it did when I first started. So, it's something. But uh, that's it. Thank you guys for tuning in. As always, I do really appreciate it. And hopefully, I will see you later. Bye.